Hey guys, that's Nan Gamney, and welcome to episode 3 of my Play More Career playthrough. And in today's episode, we are going to be playing three games. We have a home game against Morecambe in the Cup. We also have an away match with Dagenham and Redbridge, and also a home match against Torquay. So, going into the first game, uh, this is the squad that uh, has been lined up. We are in it. Um, alongside Nichols, I would have. Uh, like to be a front along with um, Akin Fenway, but never mind. So this is the teams uh, going into the match. Akin Fenway is sat on the bench, which is a bummer. And then, pretty much in the 11th minute, I just had a wonder strike. Uh, I don't know where the heck that came from. Um, and just put it straight past the keeper. Um, from my player, who's only rated 66, I think at this point in time, for him to score a goal like that is pretty much, um, pretty much a good goal. Because uh, he, he won a very good finishing, um, and basically something like that will just like come once every like blue moon. So uh, I also had another good attempt there. I just tried the volley off the cross, um, but that was a bit too ambitious. And also Markham came back on the attack, but I couldn't really do much with it. Um, the header was just well wide. Um, he didn't have the right precision on his head. And also Mark uh, Markham should have really really scored there. They had the best opportunity to. But never mind. And then, um, once again, uh, we went forward. We had another attempt, but it was just well wide as well. And that was pretty much half time. It was 1 0 to us at the moment. Uh, so, yeah, currently on, um, on loan at Northampton, if you didn't already know. And also, Akin Fen was come on for Nichols. And then Turnbull came on. Um, and then we also had another attempt there. Uh, pretty much ambitious. I just hit the defender and went straight over the, keep, uh, the bar. But that was pretty much that again. We did win 1 0. So we do proceed, and also this is um what the manager wants you as your like uncommon targets. So he wants me to score a goal, you have at least a succession rate of 15%, and yeah, another rating above um six. So this is a squad going into the next game against Dagenham Redbridge. We do have Akin Fenwa up front with me, which I'm quite proud about. Um, so it's basically me and Akin Fenwa up front, uh, the absolute beast. Um, and then pretty much. In the 17th minute, uh, it took all the way at the 17th minute to even get a shot on goal, and it just pretty much was well saved by the keeper. And then again, coming on the attack, we really probably should have scored there, but it, it was pretty much a bad shot. And then just to see this happen um, really annoyed me because it was actually their first time coming in on the attack, and he was, my, like the player just shoulder barged him on the ground and got a penalty for it. Um, unluckily. He did score it, which is a bit of a bummer, but um, there's nothing really much we could do about it. In my opinion, it was probably a bit of a soft penalty, but um, I'm guessing it's a game. They'll know everything about it. Um, but I did feel a bit hard done by it, as it was their first attack, and we've had previous attacks. Also, they did come back on the attack, uh, but luckily for me, the shot was well wide. Well, not well wide, but just put it wide, and that was pretty much half time. Then going into the second half, in the 56th minute, we did eventually score. Uh, Hackett putting the ball in the back of the net for us to equalise. I was uh, quite relieved when that went in, uh, just due to the fact the amount of pressure I was putting on uh, Dagenham, just to even get anywhere near a goal. And um, that they've only had the one attempt on goal, and that was the penalty. And um, pretty much going into a substitution, I think Harden comes off. Uh, yeah, Harden comes off. Turnbull comes on. And uh, then they make a substitution, bring uh, Woodall on, and it, eventually I did actually come off, I was substituted for Platt, which I was quite disappointed about, I actually wanted to stay on for the full game, but I still get to play as the whole team, and then eight, in the 86th minute, uh, Platt, who came on for me as a substitute, puts the ball in the back of the net, which uh, makes the game pretty much ours now, uh, pretty much a late winner, which is good for us, it's always good to see late winners. And uh, it was pretty much well taken as well. Keeper had uh, no chance of getting that. And uh, I was pretty much really, really relieved uh, when that went in. And that was full time. Uh, so I was quite pleased with that. I really did think I deserved it. And um, yeah, so amazing scenes as Northampton Town grab a late win. So Platt just is an absolute tank for us. Uh, going into the final match, uh, this is the team. Um, it is me and Platt up front. Um, so I'm guessing the ref uh, the referee, yeah, the managers just trying out uh, me, Platt, and Nichols up front. Um, so yeah, going into this game against Torquay, um, in the sixth minute, my player does actually have another one of them uh, really good shots, but it was a bit inside the box this time, and uh, just calls it straight past the keeper, just power blaster past him uh, to make it one 0 for us. Uh, so luckily, 
it's looking to be three points to us. And then in the 17th minute, I decided to sweat it. Uh, just because I want them points, I want to uh, probably I want to try and get Northampton promoted and get my rating up. Because uh, if my guy can score as many goals as he wants, his rating will go up. Um, and then we had another good attempt there, uh, but I think that was a bit too ambitious with the players. Um, but the keeper was well on par to get it. And straight off the corner, uh, we had a pretty much poor attempt on the head, but somehow magically. Um, it was a penalty. I don't know. See, I don't know what happened. I don't know whether some guy handballed it or something. But my player was there to just step up, and um, yeah. So yeah, luckily enough, I did score it, which I was quite uh, surprised about. Well, I wasn't really much surprised, but I was uh, really happy for my player, just as that was his hat trick and accomplishment was to get a hat trick with my player. Uh, so yeah. Toki did come back on the attack uh, with a corner. Um, off the first attempt, he did hit the bar, but the second time, uh, me keeper couldn't really do all that much to get it. And uh, they did actually get a consolation goal. I'm going to say that. But it was pretty much um, really bad defending just to let that guy like run through the middle. So it is pretty much 3-1 now. And um, just before half time, Turnbull has a smashing attempt uh, from outside the box, beating the keeper. And uh, that was pretty much game set and match if it wasn't already. Uh, so it is 4-1. It's not even half time yet, um, which is quite quite funny. And uh, eventually that was uh, half time. It was 4-1 to us. And then uh, Turnbull does come off for Guttridge to come on, and also Harding come off for Toza. And then Jarvis came off for Ho for them. Um, and then basically we came on the attack in the 83rd minute, just to add insult to injury. With Toza, the substitute, uh, just power blasting straight past the keeper. One on one with the keeper, the defence was in no man's land, so I just took the advantage. And uh, pretty much pressurising them into more mistakes. And then uh, we did have a good little attempt um, of hitting the bar. And then once again, there's another controversial penalty. And um, my player was once again going to step up to, to this. I did actually think that my player. Uh, didn't score his hat trick by now, so I really wanted uh, my friend who was playing this game to score it. And luckily, he did, which is uh, always good. And just uh, this is one of probably the most biggest wins of the season so far. <coughs> Excuse me, it is 6 1 to Northampton Town, uh, so he pretty much destroyed uh, Torquay. And uh, there's me, just get my hat trick. I scored four goals against uh, Torquay. This is the table as it stands, we are currently top. Uh, with winning all three games. I only played in two of them as the first one was already played before I came on loan. Uh, and at the bottom half, it currently is York, Torquay and Dagenham that I think are in the relegation zone. I'm not sure. But yeah, guys, if you did enjoy this video, then please hit the like button. It does help me out a lot. And also, subscribe so you don't miss out on any other of these videos coming out in the future. So yeah, guys, until next time, I shall talk to you guys later. Peace!